the dichotomy of my existence. This is the hypocrisy of my persistence. To fall into temptation time and time again. After praying for salvation, I fall right back into sin. This is the destruction of my immense intelligence when I conduct negligence to protect myself. This is a demonstration of how beauty can be wasted by a girl with a fascination with innocence yet runs towards predicaments to put herself in. This is the dissonance of my existence. This is the contradiction of my character. This is my affliction. I continue to devour the oxymorons and the paradoxes. I am the living document of thin lines. This is the tragedy of my personality. This is the flaw of me. This is me, personally. I am an angel full of purity. I am an angel yearning for maturity. I am an angel whose wings are so wide, ready to take flight. I am an angel with a dark side. I am the sinner whose inner demon cannot be tamed. I am far from a beginner at the tricks of the trade. I am the sinner who hurts himself. I am the sinner who cannot be helped. I'm an angel whose smile is genuine. I am the sinner whose wild, feminine aura draws her closer to provocative situations. I am an angel who's a victim of your unreasonable expectations. I am the sinner who meditates manipulations. I am an angel whose love is dedicated. I am a girl who is in dire need of love. I am a woman who is afraid to give herself up. I am a child who just wants goodness. I am a female who doesn't know what to do with all the power that I possess because I have been so blessed with a power that I am ashamed to claim through my body, through my mind, through my name. I am honest and I'm modest, I'm vain, and I'm a narcissist. I'm timid, and I'm giving. I'm tempted, and I'm sinning. I am conflicted with being gifted. I can use these tools to do good or to abuse. But the only one to lose is the one looking back at me. And when I look back in her, I see an angel who happens to be a sinner. <laughs>